So I was thinking about this over the past few weeks and have been putting this into practice both for myself and my clients. And um, the big issue that I come across with people is they want more time or they want more control or they want more money or they want more happiness. They want more. It's always more of something. Um, so as an exercise, I did it for myself and you know I'm a stickler with words. So what I decided to do for my own mindset, for my own peace of mind, was to trade. So trading the word problem for project really helped. Trading problems for projects really helps. Help me decide what was really actually a project worth taking on or not. Was it my problem or their problem? Was it a problem or not? So trading the word problem for project. Secondly, and my favorite, busy has been the buzzword for probably the past decade. And with social media and our smartphones and our computers and our schedulers and our apps and all this stuff, we like to be busy. Um, and people even ask me, oh man, I see you've been busy, you've been busy, you've been busy. Um, but I'm going to ask, and I've been doing it for myself, that we trade out the word busy for productive. Because there's plenty of times that I've been busy and wasn't necessarily productive. So, um, once I choose my projects, I ask, should I get busy doing it or should I get busy being productive? Um, so trading out busy for productive. There's a lot of busy work people can do. And I have a child in grade school and junior high, and there's plenty of busy work. I don't know that it's always productive. So being productive on your projects can really help open up your time and give you more control and maybe allow you to experience more happiness.